For Arthur Jackson Sr., Meals on Wheels isn't just a job, it's a calling. After 40 years, I, I never went out and looked for another job, so evidently this was meant for me to be. For four decades, he's brought seniors the meals they need and started by working double shifts behind the wheel and in the kitchen before becoming solely a delivery driver. Ever since I was a kid, I always kind of took to old people listening, though, because, like to say, you learn from listening. So I always like having conversation with my elders. Along the way, he's built relationships with hundreds of Chicago seniors who look to him for that hearty hello, a smiling face, and a moment of conversation. I told some, maybe a third of them, because if I told all of them, I'd never finish the route. <laughs> I'm behind now because everybody want to say goodbye, and, and a lot of them even telling me, oh, stop by and visit sometime. And now as Arthur Sr. is ready to go on the last meal routes of his career, his son, Arthur Jr., is ready to take the reins of his dad's old route. I see all the love he gets, so it's like it really inspired me to be a better guy. That's why I'm trying to take his place, and hopefully I can be as good as he is. Arthur Jackson Jr. grew up riding that route with his dad and says seeing him at work shaped the man that he's become. Just really proud that I can go and live up and try to live up to him, man. And I guess, man, just be half of the man he is, like I said. <laughs> the family affair changing lives and making Chicago proud. I'm just hoping that he enjoy it and do a better job than what I did, if possible. Happy to wake up Monday morning, get to work. In the Ashburn neighborhood on the south side, Mark Rivera, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.